In part 2 of the Cyberlink Power Producer 5 tutorials on authoring disks, we will demonstrate importing and editing videos for disks created in the program. In Cyberlink Power Producer 5, you can create VCD, DVD, Blu-ray and AVCHD disks in a variety of video recording formats and with the aspect ratio that fits both your content and playback environment. In this tutorial, we will use the project we created in part 1 and add videos to the slideshow disc we created previously. When in the content window, begin importing the videos you want on your slideshow disc. Each video you import is added as another title or scene on your disc. You can perform minor edits on videos imported into Cyberlink Power Producer. For example, you can merge two video clips together to create one longer video clip. Just add each clip to the list. And then click the Merge button to combine them all together. Let's import a second video clip, which will be the fourth title on this disc. This time we will trim out the unwanted portion from the video clip. After you set your mark in and out points, select whether to keep or delete the orange part selected. If you would like to perform more advanced editing on your videos, you can do so in Cyberlink PowerDirector Express. You can also set chapters in your videos to make your disk more navigable. To set chapters in a video, scroll through the available titles and select a video. You cannot add chapters to a slideshow. Use the playback controls to set all the chapters manually. Cyberlink Power Producer can also auto set the chapters for you through scene detection or evenly throughout the video clip based on a specified number. You can also set a frame of your video as the chapter's thumbnail, which is displayed on the chapter page of the menu by selecting the Set as Chapter Thumbnail button. Once you are done adding media to your disk, 
save your disk project and then proceed to burn it to disk when ready. In the next tutorial, we will show you how to customize your disk menu.